All right, hello everybody. Josh here. So I'm gonna yeah, I'm playing SpongeBob Battle for Battle for Battle for Bikini Bottom. I'm using um, PC free mode. I'm telling you this now because of the mic quality. I'm doing this because I'm trying to test uh, the sound quality. I don't remember what this headset sounds like. Uh, I did well. I beat the game, but I didn't necessarily beat everything. You know, I didn't get every mission. I didn't get every sock. For Patrick and I didn't. Uh, what do you have to get for it? Oh, I didn't give all my shiny objects to Mr. Krabs. So I'm obviously gonna have a whole lot of missing stuff. I recently found out how you get some spatulas in here. That's a reference to uh, Rock Bottom episode of SpongeBob, to where SpongeBob gets like lost uh, because he takes the wrong bus downtown. Leaving him stuck at rock bottom. By the way, this is where he ends up going into. Right here. There's a guy that, uh... Makes weird references. Alright, so can we go back up? Yes, we can. So what I want to do in this episode today is... I want to... Only spend I can take this axe. Okay. I want to actually go and do some missions real quick. But specifically, I want to do the boss battles for this one. At some point... I'm going to do uh, all the missions, but okay, what's the first boss? Okay, defeat King Jellyfish. Alright, let's do this one. Uh, I'm just going to see how, how many bosses I can do without dying. Hopefully this doesn't end up being a short video. This will probably be the first video I'll upload in a long time. Uh, because I haven't, I haven't, I've had the time, but I didn't know what I wanted to play. To be honest with you, is it gonna work? No? Huh. Oh man. So it's not gonna work at all? Well, we can do some random play while I'm here. Cool. So there's Larry. The only way I could, I guess I can't do that one. Can I do the, uh. Go, go, go. Let's see. Do the rumble at the Poseidon. I can't remember if this is... I think this is Sandy. If I'm correct. Does it still do the cutscene? Yes. I have brought you to here to face <laughs> Look at that. Uh, I've got nerves of steel I love the references sand. they put in here. And eyes of jelly. My Poseidon has been breached. By a mighty foe whom you must vanquish. Bring it on, your highness! Bring it on! In this corner, huh. defending the Poseidon, a small square guy! <laughs> and his challenger, a huge murderous robot shaped like a squirrel! Look, it's a giraffe! <laughs> Alright, so anyways, you gotta face Sandy. Or Robotic Sandy. Uh, this is pretty easy. Now that I know what to do. Bam. Alright, so basically you gotta... You gotta bubble... St I call it bumble. You gotta stomp whenever Sandy does her little, uh... Ground pound. Bam. Out there. Yeah, so so far I haven't got hit, which is pretty good. You can't touch the ropes if I remember correctly because they get electrified. Bam. The robot better change tactics and fa right, here we go. So it falls. And now we get to play as Patrick. So now, by the way, Patrick can't jump as fast as SpongeBob for some reason. Okay, here we go. We gotta dodge this real quick. Sling, the old clothesline move. <laughs> I can't stand a fish announcer. His bam. Okay, so now I forgot how you pick up stuff. Uh, robot's losing its head. Here we go. So I gotta quickly before S Sandy finds a head. Throw it in there. 
It shocks her. So we gotta do that two more times, I believe. I should be able to beat this without getting hit. Uh, depending on how long this lasts. Oh, I was kind of close. I might do one more. Or I might just do one like per episode, just like do boss battles. Ooh, chill, there we go. Got the head, so now we gotta run over here. Bam. Ooh, nice flying uh, head thing moved by Patrick. <laughs> Yo, like these uh these uh ad libs are hilarious, dude. I'm just trying to get thinking to work. Oh, for some reason that didn't reach already down here. Here comes a little clothesline joint. That's easy to dodge. Damn, like, I can do it, like, almost synchronized to the point. Okay, where is it at? All right. Bam, so we're done with that part. This motherfucker talking about some yo turn. This dude talking about some yo turn. Sorry about that, guys. This little... Patrick has always been stupid. I don't know why. I don't know why I'm jumping. Because it doesn't reach. Okay, so now we gotta deal with the uh, close. What? Oh, man. I got hit. You kidding me? Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. What? I'm getting my butt whooped. What? That's my last pair of underwear. Are you kidding me? Okay. Oh, you gotta jump one time on that one. I gotta wait on her to. Bam! There we go. Come on! Really? Oh my god! Please! There we go. For real? Why was that hard? Well, I did say uh, I want to do this and not die. But it would have been dope if I could have not gotten hit. Really? Come on, man. Shut up, Sandy. And Fish announcer guy. All right, well. Bam. Okay. Get too early. There you go. This match is just about over. The graphics back in the day weren't that great, but the gameplay was a whole lot better. I want to be able to get the chance to get uh, Simpsons uh, hit and I think it's hit and run. I don't think it's road rage. I think it's hit and run to where you get, go around and do missions for people. I love that game. Alright, so we won. Bam! Right. <laughs> that was quite a battle. Tell him what he's won, Johnny. It's a new power, the bubble bowl. But wait, there's more. A golden spatula. And that's not all. A gift certificate for five dollars and thirty-two cents to Dean's little shop of dried fish flakes and flowers. <laughs> Thank you, it all means so much. I. I. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Cry all you want. But not here. We just wax the floors. Oh, by the way, we don't get the special because we've already gotten it, so. Yep, so that was it, guys. Uh, I don't think I'm going to do another one on today. Just a nice little simple gameplay. Do a little boss battle. I thought I was going to do it without getting hit. But no. I was being a major noob. And I wasn't able to do it right. Uh, I will go and visit Spongebob's Dream right now. But that involves rolling all the way down to uh, places I want to go right now. This game was somewhat of a challenge back when I was younger. But not really. 
it wasn't a challenge until I got like to the uh, last part of it being where you have to fight plankton and it's mad hard like dude it's so hard uh, okay we're gonna I'm just gonna roll around and tell you what I'm gonna do now so what I'm doing is I'm not gonna play any new games yet because I haven't really gotten any new games that have fought coming out I want a new console that's the only actual real way I'm gonna be able to do that and uh, it's gonna be a while unless I magically get like this awesome job that pays me like a whole lot of money to where I can just buy a new console right away I probably won't be able to do it so anyways guys that's it I uh, love y'all it has been Josh and I'll see you guys later